So well, it looks everything. like we've got a handle on this whole leadership thing for the time being. It yeah, does. hashtags MP, leader, and let's go have been trending on social for the better part of 48 hours. So Okay. I'm Congrats. impressed. Right, hey, but uh, can your source find out if Adele is still trying to trade a rising young star with leadership abilities up the wazoo? Oh, don't talk about yourself in the third person. <laughs> yeah, mm. it plays terribly with boomers, and that's our most affluent demo. And don't say wazoo. <laughs> and don't dodge Thank the question. <laughs> it's not that funny. I mean, uh, I really want you to work your source here, Ricky, you know? Or does Teresa from Ticketing still have insights? <laughs> it's not Teresa from Ticketing. Then who is ticketing? it, man? Look, you're going to tell me. You. You're going to tell me. Look, just because you're doing a great job right now does not mean you can let your foot off the gas. Mm -hmm. Like, mm -hmm. I will try and see where Othello's head is at, but you still got to do your thing, all right? Like, nothing's settled on the trade front. Of course, man, but <laughs> it only gets better from here, Rick. Trust me. <laughs> all right, well, you know, it might be a good idea for you to check in with Coach Graves, too. Yes. I mean, he's an ally on this one. Hmm. Yeah, I do, talk, you know, chat with him every day, but... You know, maybe I can see what, uh, if he knows what Othello's thinking or doing. Good, good. In the meantime, I'll hit up my source, and we'll take it from there. One day at a time, right? Yes, sir. One way to do. Hey. What's up? It's time to talk about Hammond. Oh, let's go, man. I've been dying to get on those courts. I know. So talk to me. What's the plan? What are we doing? So you've got to keep winning over the fans. Mm -hmm. You're doing a great job with that so far, but we just can't go to Hammond right now with the level of support you have. It wouldn't be good from a PR perspective. I mean, we don't want a bunch of Twitter videos of people clowning you at the court. Yeah, no, that does not sound good at all. Yeah, no. <laughs> so that's one thing. But the bigger issue mm -hmm. is Kenny Cruz. The godfather of Hammond Park. You know it. He is street ball in the city. And more importantly, he is its toughest gatekeeper. You can't hoop at Hammond without his say-so. Wait, wait, so even me being an NBA player is not enough to get his say-so? That's correct. That's crazy. <laughs> you have to prove it in the streets, in his streets. Okay, so just keep balling up on the courts. Yeah, but not just any courts. The city has a feeder system. Moss Point, Robert Miles Park, and Dreamer Park. Park yeah. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Kenny. And P. Glad you're here. Uh, I gotta talk to you. Yeah, man, I was about to say what's up, but uh, you look a little bit upset. There's no easy way to say this, but uh, you're out of the starting lineup. I don't understand why. It's beyond my control. But you said you would help me if I stayed out the press. I can help you. Okay, how? By doing whatever Adela tells you to do? Ernest, get over here. MP, I'd like you to meet Ernest Templeton. Pleasure to meet you. Nice to meet you too, man. Uh, what exactly does Ernest here do? He's one of the brightest young stars in our analytics department. Analytics? Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. He came up with the formula for teammate grade, our new all-in-one performance metric. That was you, man? Yes. You like it? Yeah, I read the documents up on it. Makes a lot of sense. I'm just excited to see it in action. When you see yourself going up for posterizing dunk, what do you see? A unicorn flying over a rainbow. What I see is a series of zeros and ones in the beautiful pattern of a Wolverine hoovering down on his opponents. It's mathematical, inevitability. I've been working on it for a long time. Long time, huh? Yeah, 89, 99, 2009. Time doesn't exist. <laughs> it's been extensive research, but we'll spare you the details. Spare you the details. Needless to say, Needless to it's the new gold standard. New gold the standard. Boyer wants the us to Boyer. use it as a central pillar in all player Notice evaluation. Say all of these things. Teammate grade. This is how we change the narrative. How are you going to achieve a better grade than the starter that's currently in place? Here's how you're going to do it. I gotta play six games coming off the bench because of this. You hit those goals, and we'll have no we'll choice but to start you. The boy will see to it himself. I got you, coach. Just say Enough, Ernest. We're all pulling for you, MP. We're all pulling for you, MP. We know you can do this. Wait, all right, I'm gonna get out of here. But uh, I got you, coach. I got you, coach. Wow. They pinned me back on the bench. Back on the goddamn 
bench. What's it like to play in a game? Wow. I'm fed up, man. Let's just get into it, bro. Let's just get into it. Let's go, Simmons. You too light, boy. You too light. Move your ass out the way. And one. I love it. Eat up. Eat up. I love that you actually make that shit, bro. You know the gang soldier. It's time for the takeover. Let's work. Come on. Beautiful job. Put your joggles on. That's beautiful, boy. I love it. Let's go, Clark. That's work. Let's work, Fox. Clark, let that fly. I respect that, man. Let that fly. I like that. The pass. You know the game, soldiers. Time for the takeover. Let's work. Mm. Good work, Ja. Good work, Ja. That's beautiful, boy. Come on. Oh my goodness. That's how you work him, Ja. That's how you work him, Ja. That's work, man. Come on. And one. Let's go to work. Mm. Mm. You know my nigga the damn man Put him on a slam cam That's disgusting Look at the flight boy Come on Let's work Ja I love it Go to work Period man Got a kid on me. Here's Fox. And one. Mouse in the box with Fox. We weak, bro. When it's a mouse in the box with Fox, we eat those. And one. Let's work. <laughs> Kyrie, bro. That's, that's just beautiful. Watch out, man. How do you not give me the ball? This guy is too small down here, man. It looked the rock. You no know, FO on the back down with posters like Shaq now. Let's go. Switch this up. Switch this up or else I'm abusing. Switch this up. Send me to the line that man dumb. You know I'm gonna convert the N1. Switch that up, bro. Wow, Ja. That's just absolutely amazing. Broke him down. That's work, man. Come on. Brooklyn's gone into a Here's Fox. The shot misses. So Brooklyn will take it the other way. Brooks. They shoot again. Oh my goodness. What the? What? Do you understand how big my boy is down here, man? Huh? Let's work, man. And throw it down. Defense got Oh. 
So no problem for Memphis as they get the win. What was my grades? What the hell? They really just kept me out the game for the Hall of Fame. There it is. Oh, teammate grade right there. A plus, okay. Oh, got badges. Oh, we got badges. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Let's work, man. What they want to talk about since <laughs> what I tell you, they got your boy MP back on the bench. Took him long. Damn. Then way too long. Sometimes you can't look away from a train wreck. They probably was mesmerized by all that failure. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think you mean hypnotized, though. No, I mean mesmerized. I know what I mean, Pookie. Well, I'm just, I'm just saying, man. I'm just trying to help you out. Thank you for your concern. Hey, you know I got you, bro. You got me paying your bills is what you got me. Yeah, but come on, I'm a bargain. I don't know if you know, but I'm pretty high demand, bro. Benching me like this. It's not right. What's up, everybody? Oh, hold, hold on. What's your question, John? Thanks, MP. Can you tell us about the decision to move you to the bench? I mean, from day one, I've always said I'm happy to come, you know, from any points of the court, off the bench, on the bench, whatever. You know, just think about Manu. He's a Hall of Famer, and he came off the bench as well. I mean, if Coach thinks I need to come off the bench to help us win, I'm riding with Coach on this. I'm all for it. You know, it's tough for me to see the logic behind your benching from a performance perspective. Exactly. I mean, is there something going on behind the scenes that we don't know about? Maybe like a disciplinary action situation? Nope. Nothing like that. Okay, so then tell me, does the benching feel vindictive to you? Vindictive? For what? <laughs> I don't know. I mean, if you don't know, then I definitely don't know. You're <laughs> as plugged in as anyone else, Nate. Talk to me. Ah, I guess. Well, thanks, anyway. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Uh, seems like we're done here, huh? All right, see you guys later. They benching the kid. If you rock with me, like, really, though, I mean, really, bro, leave a like on the video. Yo.